Welcome to the channel. My name is Matthew and today we're going to talk quickly about custom made tie rod sleeves. I see a lot of people get hung up on this when they're trying to put random things together, especially like the C10 group of people. Those kids over there are always taking like an 87 Chevy truck with metric stuff and using like a 66 tie rod on like 54 ball joints, but it, it, uh, there's a whole bunch of stuff that happens when you get into the C10 garbage. Lots of garbage. When you need custom made tie rod sleeves, the, I have the answer for you. Just call up your buddy Dan at DCA Race Fab and he'll make them for you. It's that easy. You're gonna need your outer tie rod or heim joints thread, and you're also gonna need whatever your steering linkages or inner tie rod situation is. He'll cook you up the best tie rod sleeve that money can buy. And speaking of money, it's super reasonably priced. Here's just one of their mild steel sleeves. I've got it threaded for a 5 8 left hand thread on this side to go into a heim joint, and a 9 16 by 18 right hand thread on this side, so that way when I spin it, it'll actually push and pull the tie rods out, just like a real car. You can even ask those cute guys over there to mill down the end so you've got a good wrench point. Or if you're some sort of animal, you can just use a monkey wrench and destroy the finish. I don't care. It's yours. I don't you know what? You do you. Every set the guy's ever made for me has taken longer for the actual shipping than it did for him to make it. Like seriously, if I call in the morning, he'll have it by the afternoon and two days later I'll get it. That's amazing. Also remember that when you're specking like the custom length of your tie rod sleeve, you need to account for a minimum of two and a half times the diameter of the shaft that you're actually threading it onto. So in this case, we have a 9 16 inner steering shaft thread. Two and a half times will get us basically one and three quarters. So remember that your tie rod sleeve has to be a minimum of one and three quarters inches on this little guy or else you risk, you know, safety. And I'd also give yourself a little bit of wiggle room. So when you take it to an alignment shop, they can actually push things back and forth to get your steering wheel aligned. There it is. It's that easy. I have no endorsements or sponsorships by them. I've just used them several times and they are wonderful people with a wonderful product that's reasonably priced. We should support them. Have a good one.